Hey guys, thanks for tuning in. In the never-ending quest to improve gameplay on my laptop, I decided to upgrade my hard drive to an SSD. The hope was that it would improve graphic performance when I play Train Simulator 2016. Here are the specs of my system before and after the SSD upgrade. If you'd like to see how I installed this SSD drive, click the link here or in the description to see a full video on how I did the installation. In that video, you'll see how Windows startup time was improved from about a minute to 23 seconds after installing the SSD drive. But let's take a look at how this new SSD drive affected the startup time, load time, and performance of Train Simulator 2016. Here's a side-by-side -side comparison of starting up Train Simulator 2016 right after a Windows reboot. I think that just about speaks for itself. Now let's take a look at the difference between load times of a scenario in Train Simulator 2016. This is from a fresh startup of Train Simulator 2016 right after a Windows reboot. We all know how frustrating this can be. So safe to say that a scenario will load in about a third of the time. Now let's take a look at the differences in gameplay. I'm doing a full screen record with fraps at 30 frames per second at 1920 by 1080 pixels. Now, Fraps has always added a little bit of lag, but we'll see how this translates with the new SSD drive. Also, this is done at medium graphics resolution. I should also add that with Fraps off, I saw a significant improvement in video quality. With the SSD, it was very smooth at medium. In fact, I was able to even ratchet up to high graphics and it was still smooth. The next item on my list is to get an external video capture device to really improve my uh, YouTube videos. But I'll let you guys be the judge of this particular test here.
I have to say that after seeing the results of upgrading to this SSD drive, I'm very impressed. Not only does it improve the gameplay and the experience, but certainly other aspects of using this PC. Especially when Fraps is not running. I also have a 16 gig memory upgrade on order. Should be here next week and that should help improve things even more. So thanks for watching and I hope this video was helpful. Please hit the like button, comment if you'd like, and also please hit the subscribe button. Thanks for watching and have a great day.